Hello everyone and welcome back to my lessons. So today we are going to do something quite interesting called picture describing. Uh, this kind of exercises or tasks come up frequently in uh, competitive examinations like TOEIC or maybe some exams in Cambridge like PET or CAT, yes? So today we are going to describe one picture that is related to country life or foreign life. Okay, uh, let's see. So the main key to success in describing a picture lies in knowing the vocabulary words. There are many things that we can see and maybe we understand what they are, but we need to know the English names for each and every item in this picture. The more detailed your descriptions are, the better your chances are of scoring high. Okay, so let's deal with the vocabulary first. Let's see, I'll point out each item in the picture and write down the vocabulary words for them. First, this is what? This is a paddy field, right? So first of all, we write down paddy field. That's our first vocabulary word. Okay, let's see. Who are these people? They are farmers, right? Okay. Farmers, so we write down farmers. Now, what are they wearing? They're wearing typical farming clothes. Typical farming clothes. Now, what do uh, what, what do these clothes include? Okay, let's see. Uh, they're wearing hats and shirts and these thin belts called retainers. They're also wearing belts uh, in their waists and they're wearing trousers, they're wearing shoes. Okay, let's see. Hats, shirts, retainers, belts, trousers, Okay, shoes. These are the things that they wear when they work in the field, normally. Okay, now let's see. What is that long stick thing this farmer is using? We call that a hoe. Hoe is a common agricultural tool. Okay, and wha what are these things? So they have finished uh, cutting the rice, so it's called harvesting, yes? They have finished harvesting the rice, and they have tied the rice into small bundles, yes? Okay, so these things are called bundles. Right, uh, what is the farmer doing? He is putting the bundles from the ground onto this horse wagon. Oh yeah, this thing is called a horse wagon. Horse wagon. So this farmer is uh, putting all the bundles of rice onto the horse wagon. So we have one word for this, it's called loading, yes? He is loading the rice bundles onto the horse wagon. What is the other farmer doing? He's standing on the horse wagon and he's helping the other farmer. All right, so this is called the horse wagon. Of course, these are called horses. Horses, right. And what else can we see? Behind the paddy field, we can see a forest. Yes, so we write down, okay, forest. Awesome, okay, one second, what is that? Mm -hmm. Right, oh, so we write down forest or jungle okay and in the sky we can see a lot of white clouds yes so we write down clouds and you can also see the sky is quite clear and bright if you want okay now we have all the vocabulary words we can start describing the picture yes <coughs> so you can see in this picture I can see a paddy field on the paddy field I can see two farmers working they have finished harvesting the rice and they have tied the rice into small bundles. The farmers are wearing typical farming clothes like hats and shirts and retainers and belts and trousers and shoes. The farmer standing on the ground is using a hoe to load the bundles of rice onto the horse wagon. The second farmer is standing on the wagon and helping the first farmer. I can see two strong horses. Uh, okay, they are harnessed. We have one more vocabulary word. They are harnessed to the horse wagon. Okay, I can see two strong horses harnessed to the horse wagon. Okay, and behind the paddy field, I can see a forest. And in the sky, there are a lot of white clouds. The day seems to be very bright and sunny. Okay, that's about it about the description. Now let's see. We have to focus on the pronunciation also. So now I'll show you how to pronounce all these new vocabulary words. I will pronounce each word or phrase 
and after that I'll stop for a few seconds so that you can repeat after me. Okay, let's start. Paddy field, farmers, typical farming clothes, hats, shirts, retainers, belts, trousers, shoes, hoe, harvesting, bundles, horse wagon, loading, horses, forest or jungle, clouds, harnessed. Okay, so I think all these vocabulary words are going to help you a lot in the future because you never know what kind of picture you're going to be given in any kind of test. Try your best, try to find many pictures and try to find out uh, the English names for each and every item in the picture. Try to use them in describing the pictures and practice hard, really, really hard. Okay, so see you and have a wonderful time. Bye-bye.